In this lesson, you will learn about the concept of division. So here we have Zippy. Zippy went to the zoo earlier, but today he has his three triplet brothers with him. And he went to the store and he bought his brother some candy. So he puts his candy out and the brothers all need to have the same amount of candy so that it's fair. So we're going to divide this into equal groups, okay? So each brother is going to get the same number of candies. So we're giving each brother one candy at a time. So how many candies is this all together? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12 candies. The 12 candies, each brother gets the same amount of candy. So we started with 12 candies and we divided it by three brothers. And we got one, two, three, four in this group, one, two, three, four in this group, one, two, three, four in this group. So 12 candies divided into three equal parts is four in each group, okay? Now let's say that Zippy wanted some of that candy as well. So we can, re we still have the 12 candies here, but this time we're going to divide it into four groups. So we have 12 divided by four. And how many will be in each group? So let's see, Zippy gets one, and the brothers each get one. Zippy gets one, and the brothers each get one. Zippy gets one, and the brothers each get one. So we still have 12 candies, but this time we've divided them into four groups. How many are in each group? Well, we can see one, two, three here. One, two, three, one, two, three, and one, two, three. So 12 divided by four is three. And that's the end of our lesson on the concept of division.